Those guys are next. I'm gonna wait one turn to reinforce. Now I'll go for those guys. Josephilic Vukasevich. Going down probably next turn. And Omuts will probably go down. I'm gonna recruit one thing here just in case. They don't, and I can just have some defenses. Oh, this happened too. Hmm. Let's see. I'll, I'll, I think I could take them. I could probably take them. They have some more artillery guns than me, although. Well, they have one 12 pounder, actually. What do I have? I have eight pounders, and. They have one 12 pounder, so. I And the rest are six pounders, so. As long as I take out their 12 pounder, I'll outrange them. And they'll have to come to me. I know I do that a lot, but if I have the artillery advantage, why bother? Here we are, battle. We got a pretty nice looking field here, I'll be honest. It's pretty nice, and the Austrians are gonna have a strange time advancing. They have some weird crap going on here, some weird formations on this side. To my advantage. And they are. They spawn in the town. Um. I mean, they'll probably come out to get me, to be honest. The AI is pretty aggressive. The AI attacks most of the time, so... I just don't want to have to fight through the town. That'll just be a nuisance, but I probably probably won't have to. Let's get everyone set up in their little groups, and then I will position them. If you notice, I kind of have one... I mean, depends on the battlefield, but if it's kind of open like this, I mean... I don't think I can go wrong with it. It's pretty much just the infantry all in one line. In the center, obviously. I mean. And then I usually have my cannons either behind my line, but in this case I want to get as close as possible. I'm actually going to do that thing I did before, actually. I'm going to kind of put them in a V. I'm going to take these guys out. I stick them here. How uphill is that? Not very uphill. Alright, that's fine. But yeah, infantry in the middle, cannons. Usually I try to put them on a flank behind my dudes or in the center like that, depending on how the enemy artillery is. And then cavalry on the flanks, they kind of also act as reserves and reinforcements, really. I usually. I'm not so aggressive with my cav until I have a cav advantage, and that's only if the enemy artillery is still a threat. Usually I keep my cav in the back to react to advances on my line, and then maybe if enemies get stuck in on my line, I'll put them on the flanks and then turn them on the enemies. But I'm not very aggressive with cav most of the time. But the enemy has this equal cav to mine. So I'm in range here. Their six pounders are not in range, really. I'm gonna try to aim for this twelve pounder right away. I can have my twelve pounders aim directly for it. Well my my eight pounders they'll probably hit it to be honest. Even though they're not directly on it. Well these guys just took some hits already, jeez. Now once their their twelve pounders are down, I mean the AI will probably move up since their well at least their cannons will move up. Oh, look at that. I hate how that it marks that for you. The enemy placed it there, obviously. I shouldn't be able to see that. Jeez. Oh, I just caused damage to, to both of these cannons. Oh, that means the enemy's charging. <laughs> but I shouldn't be able to see this. I mean that's obvious. Maybe you should only see it if you're close enough, and only if it's like a light infantry unit that... I don't, know, I, I don't know how they would be better at spotting it than anyone else, but I have a feeling that'd be more like a scouting unit that'd be able to see it. Or maybe uh, cavalry, since they would be higher up a little bit. But then again, they would. I don't think they'd be better at spotting it than infantry. But make it... have it make sense in some way just not be able to see it instantly. They're just going to do this with their cavalry. They didn't have fun. I'm just going to readjust their cavalry. I'm just going to take it out instantly. <laughs> and they run away. The AI knows. 
That's metagaming. You're not getting away that easily. Look at this balloon right here. Oh, they stop shooting. Shoot back. No. What are you doing? At least... Yeah. Aim here, then. Let's, let's go into the balloon real quick. Let's, uh... Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's, uh... Can I... That's it. Whatever. Balloon. Yay. There you go. Hmm. I'm actually going... I think I'm going to stop the recording here first. Uh, until something happens. Because I'm going to take out their artillery. When the enemy starts moving, I will record again. Alright, so I've event I've pretty much obliterated the enemy's artillery. Um, and they're starting to make some moves. They have some already pieces left, but it's not a whole lot. These guys are done. You see they have just units just kind of on their own. Doing their thing. They pretty much have this unit left, and they've got one cannon there, which I will just deal with it. They also have reinforcements coming from here. It's just one unit, I believe, but that was kind of weird. I'll bring these guys back here. I won't need them. I want to move my guys... I'm not sure if I want to move them up the hill, because uh, I have more of an even footing if I'm <coughs> more down here. The slope's more gradual, but uh, I still might... Uh, oh, I lost one cannon. I didn't even notice that. Rip cannon. I didn't lose any guys from the unit, though. I'm gonna cough. I can feel it. <coughs> I'm alright. They're just gonna run pretty much. Well, this city's blocking them, so I'm gonna start to move my guys up. Let's get everything going here. These guys, surprisingly, not taking a whole lot of casualties. Let's get that V thing going. Man, I haven't really used the V until this Let's Play, man. Man. My dog. Alright, let's get this, let's get this v, v status right here. Okay. Take out that cannon, please, blocks. It's the one cannon. Actually, two cannons. Take them out. There can be no survivors from the artillery of the Austrian army. And I'll have my first three guys run. These guys can take their time. Nope, actually, everyone needs to run. Take them out. Come on, guys. Let's go. How things going here? Oh, they actually killed a lot of my cavalry. This is actually almost a shame for a display right here. So let's fix this. Let's get my cavalry out of the way. We'll have my my Volagares do it. Shooting these guys. Alright, well, the enemy already is kind of in a safe spot, so. Let's put my guys in canister and fire at will. Because there will be dudes coming in here. I'll actually have these guys just aim right for those horses. They're actually, actually they're coming in. They're coming in the range. Oh, yeah. These guys route. Cool. Cool. These guys are depleted, but I'll just put them over here. Alright, so this isn't turning up to much of a fight. Uh, my already kind of pounded the hell out of everything walking up here. 
I found the hell out of really everything. All the remnants of the Austrian artillery, and they had units sitting behind the artillery. They took tons of losses. Their army overall took tons of losses during the bombardment. And they just walked right into a trap, essentially. I just ran my guys up in a V, and they just got shot to death. So Austria not having a good day right now. Start to... Are they going to walk into the, the thing? No. I'll start firing normal round shot at them. The AI's having trouble deciding where it wants to go. It's essentially just trapped in here. Unless they want to go back. I don't think they want to do that. I'm going to set my guys here. Up here. I don't have to kill anyone routing since uh, this is a siege. There's just no fortifications. So all the enemies will die. And they are within the arc, so let's start firing canister at these fools. I'm also gonna just cavalry right there. I actually don't want to do that. Did my horses from earlier route? Oh, damn. The ones that had like 80 something guys left too. Place those spikes, do it. Do it faster, fools. Uh oh, that's not what I want. <laughs> what? <laughs> Are they just gonna go up there? They can't come down. Oh shit. Got the spikes. Got the spikes ready. My infantry's not shooting their own dudes. Oh, those guys have to place the spikes. Just place the spikes, dudes. Come on, place them. No, that's not what I want you to do. That's weird. This is really weird what's happening right now. My guys just kind of slid up there. Well, the battle's essentially won already. Let's finish them off, I guess. So I need to shoot anything yet. No, you're shooting my own dudes. Why? Come on, place the stakes. They're not even charging. This was pointless. Okay, they're just gonna do that creepy spin. There you go. Just take that stake out of your pocket, wherever you had it. Just line back up. That's good enough for me. Ooh. Ooh, got a hit on those guys, those fools. I don't need to kill anyone routing. Let's shoot those guys in the back. Oh, nice. Felix von Ironhoff is dead. He's in the ground. Oh, okay. This is the later bullet. Gunshot from a the general dead notice. It wasn't actually a general, it was a colonel, since he's attached to a just a regular unit. Good. Nice. And uh, that should be it. Vienna's mine. Oh, no, they got one unit that decided to stay. Oh, they started routing and they came back. Okay, they, they ended up routing. Heroic victory, of course. Only the best for France. Alright, so that actually was not, not a very difficult battle. Only lost 325 men. They just walked right into the death trap, the Austrians. I'm peacefully occupy. I don't want to deal with all the unrest. So, Vienna's mine. Austria's not not gone. But uh, they have no more major cities. Major being that it has all the buildings. They have some buildings, like Lemberg's got two slots. That's really it. They're at war. I think they're at war with the Ottomans. That would be nice if they like take some territory or something. 
I'll, I'm probably going to turn on the Ottomans later. Did I already move that guy? Yeah. Oops. Now, hopefully I am taxing the Austrians. It can be that for one turn. That's okay. Because uh, there's a lot of people here. I want to tax them. Making a lot of money. Secure money this time. I don't have to have a turn. I also got a school that's probably going to get raided instantly, but let's put them on something. Let's do that. No. Land drainage. It's about to get destroyed by Marcus Laube, probably. Laub. Fucking Laub. Hopefully Almuts lives. There, did you try to try that? Apparently not this turn. God damn! Saxony is gonna be a bitch now. I had no idea I was at war with them. Actually, since I already took Vienna, I'm gonna use this army. March on Saxony. Might as well. 